Hey, what is up guys? So, um, what you see in front of you is real. It actually exists. And this amazing big-brained person at the store, Harriet, played this. And made top half at the OTS event. When I mean she made top half, I mean that she beat Sky Striker in coming top half. She beat two sprite players in coming top half. She beat Dino in coming top half. She even beat Dark World in coming top half. So this was just... I don't know how this happened, but um, congratulations, Harriet. Um, you've done very well to actually make the top half um, at Halifax. Um, that probably says that probably says more about us than it says about anything else. Um, however, my justification to it is I was head judge that day, so um, yeah, I wasn't playing Runic Plunder, I wasn't playing Eldritch, I wasn't playing anything else. But I have no idea how this deck functions, not in the slightest, and. The ratios, um, I'm just going to have to be perfectly honest, um, the ratios are um, interesting to say the least. So a little bit of backstory to this, um, Harriet's one of our good players that is like the top um, at being happy in the event. Um, she'll literally just celebrate if she comes last, um, she probably smile, has it on a smile on her face. Um, where's the uh, coming last? Better than probably any of us ever could. So she kind of deserves to be um, in this position because she's just a casual player that plays this for fun and playing for fun has just proven that it can do very, very well. Um, I'm not going to go through the side because we can all see the side and um, it's a bunch of one-offs. So I don't know if she used the side deck or not for the tournament. She might have. She might not have. I don't think she did. I'll have to question her on that. Um, as for the extra, it was literally three of every Amazonist card and then some other stuff from the bulk that was kind of chucked in. Uh, the stuff from the bulk was uh, the Generator, the Goki the Great Ogre, and um, yeah, the whatever the heck this is. Um, I don't think she actually summoned anything of the blue cards. She only summoned uh, all these lovely, lovely purple cards and don't even know the combo line that she was trying to get to. I'll probably, next time I see Harriet, I'll have to go full on Spanish Inquisition and ask her how she piloted this and how she won three matches. That's just something I'm going to have to question, but we're just going to do the deck list um, and from there, I'll kind of sit down with her and see if I can actually give a better explanation next time I decide to have a look at this deck. Um, but the list goes as follows. Um, three Baby Tiger, three Golden Whip, three Princess, two Queen, three Swordsmaster, two Spiritualist, two Spy, and one Swordswoman. And then for the spells, um, one Fighting Spirit, three secret art one spellcaster two village one dark hole one lightning vortex three uh two poly one rota two warrior returning alive and then for the traps amazonis hall two hot spring two onslaught and three willpower um the only card that i know in this deck off the top of my head is willpower and it's not just because the screen is left currently open on this but it my only thought is like wh why no monster reborn instead of this and with the lightning vortex why just not double dark hole unless no second dark hole but not the discard fodder unless there is some card in here that does work off discarding i will never know um warrior returning alive change that for desires I don't know. I have no clue. I'm just completely speculating here. Um, as for the uh, extra deck, there is three Amazonists, Augustus, three Empress, two, three Pet Liger, one Pet, three Amazonists Pet Liger King, and then the generic one-offs. So, 
I don't know how this functions, and um, please, anyone that actually has ever played this deck, uh, let me know in the comment section below how this deck actually functions, um, so I can give a bit more of an honest and better explanation to this. And uh, again, congratulations, Harriet, for making top half at the OTS. Um, you're better than half the players that we've got now.